uh, Blacklandia is a series of events, cultural events, that is hosted and supported by the Inlandia Institute. And Inlandia is literary and cultural nonprofit that serves Riverside and San Bernardino counties. And we are a very vibrant, creative uh, nonprofit that supports uh, poets, writers, creative artists, creative thinkers. And as a, as a direct result of the events of summer 2020 and the murder of George Floyd in May of that year, Inlandia Institute really wanted to recommit in a public way to communities of color and to make sure that we as an organization that serves such a large part of inland Southern California, that we were helping to spotlight and uh, support what was already happening in the community. So every month we have numerous programs. No, obviously being Black History Month, were there any special events through Blacklandia that, uh, that were put on this month? Blacklandia started uh, sort of the celebrating Black History Month with a program on February 3rd, which was called Language of Healing, the Poetry of Hope. And it was really a wonderful round table. Romaine Washington, who's a local educator and poet, James Coates, Lydia Theon, where I, and George Hammonds, all really wonderful writers who have been published. They shared not only their own work, but um, they took the discussion to a point of inspiration, self-care, and looking towards the future. We also had a, a tremendous program on, on Saturday, February 5th, a writing series, writing about black art with artist Richard Allen May III, and really exposing people who maybe weren't aware of the long tradition of, of visual artists uh, that, uh, that, that we've had. The next day we had a program, which was a conversation between two authors. Keenan Norris is a local writer, professor, um, thinker, uh, leader, and uh, he was presented in conversation with author and educator Eric Devon, a novelist and essayist, um, short story writer. Uh, Keenan discussed the latest novel, The Confession of Copeland Kane, and this online event was free, like most of Blacklandia events are free and open to the public. What do you feel makes Black History Month so important? And African-American heritage is very rich and really kind of wonderful and vibrant and diverse. It's not all one thing. So yeah, uh, it's important to have time to, to be able to focus on that and for people to learn about it, as well as for people who do know about it to celebrate it.